Okay, why won't your instructor allow you to use Wikipedia as a source for your paper? You'll, you'll find this pretty regularly, no matter where you go to college or university, is um, faculty at colleges and universities really don't like you to like you to be citing Wikipedia in your papers as a source. So why is that? Well, it's hard to argue with Wikipedia themselves. Wikipedia on their site posted an article saying they really don't think it should be used for academic writing or research. So it's hard, it's hard to argue that Wikipedia should be used for that when Wikipedia themselves say that they you shouldn't do this. The reasons they list is that you can see this really whether you knew it or not in a Wikipedia article anyone can go in and edit this. So I could go in and edit this right now and I really don't know all that much about healthcare in the United States but there's no verification process that verifies I'm an expert before I can edit it. I can just start editing it. And as they state in this article they do check it they try to check them for errors, but they can't. They they can't monitor thousands of edits made every day. Uh, some of these edits could contain vandalism or could be simply wrong. So while there is some error checking by the community that monitors this page, they 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 can't catch every single error. And I think most of what I've seen on Wikipedia is pretty good. There's no guarantee of it, and Wikipedia doesn't give any guarantee. That the information is accurate. So that's that's the problem. I know we all know Wikipedia is great for getting up to speed on a topic very quickly. It is it is good for that. But another problem is it's all the work is kind of all done for you here. Someone else or a lot of a whole community has gone through a lot of sources and provided a, a summary. And I'm not sure you're really going to learn that much by just letting someone else do all that work for you. This is what's called a tertiary source. It's or it's like a, like a third level source. You've heard of primary sources, a source from the source. That's someone who's a witness to an event or someone who does the research themselves. Secondary source is analyzing and writing about that original primary source research. A third level source or tertiary source is a compilation of analysis of a lot of different sources like a textbook or a Wikipedia page and it's kind of your instructors kind of want you to be the person reflecting on that research not just taking it from a community or a bunch of other people this is like a paper written by a bunch of people so what I would do if you want to use Wikipedia I think it's I think it's pretty good what I would do is use their sources we find a good article and you find a point that makes sense they have the points footnoted here to go down to their sources uh, go down to the end of the article and they list all their sources and there's a lot of great references here and a lot of these are full text a lot of these like right there national health expenditures 2016 highlights I can go to their sources but for my paper what my instructor wants to see my instructor wants me to see me analyzing these sources and coming up with conclusions and doing some work they don't want to see me just using someone else's reflection or analysis of this which is which is what this is and also, uh, as Wikipedia states themselves here, there, there, there have been plenty of inaccuracies and vandalism found in Wikipedia sources, enough so that most instructors just don't want to have to bother with having to validate this thing that the source itself says that is that they won't stand behind and validate because it was never intended to be an academic research tool. This is a community information tool, and it's great for that. But when you start seeing it as a uh, a reliable academic source that you're going to use for your papers, it's really it was never intended to be that. So hopefully that will uh, make some sense to you as to why your instructor does not want to see you using Wikipedia. Biggest reason would be Wikipedia themselves recommend that it not be used as an academic source. So there's my summary. It is a great place to get up to speed quickly on a topic. If you want to use one of these pages to get up to speed, just don't cite it get up to speed really quickly and maybe this could spark some ideas for you or get some vocabulary going so you could run some some searches some research on your own that's how i would use it and just don't just don't cite it as your and don't use it as your main source and then if you want to go down to their sources and use use these sources here that they used and that's fine there's my advice on that hopefully that makes sense to you uh, let me know if you have any questions thank you very much for watching Bye-bye.